I'm shocked. <laughs> I'm devastated, you know, just to see a little kid and to know it happened here. Neighbors here at the Forest Houses are not only in complete shock, but are emotional after hearing about the death of 60-year-old Jalea Eason and the child's mother being questioned in connection to her death. That's horrible. How dare you as a mom, as a dad, whoever you are, how dare you? I'm so broken. Police responded to the family's apartment early Friday morning after Jalea's mother called 911. That's when they found the little girl unresponsive with bruising and trauma on her hands and torso. Sources tell PIX11 News the mother told detectives her daughter went to bed around 11 Thursday night. But when she went to check on Jalea in the overnight hours, she found her out of her bed on the floor near a closet. I'm just so heartbroken to hear that that baby died. At the hospital, detectives took a closer look into the family and questioned the mother. Police say Jalea and her two siblings, ages eight and three, were living in filthy and unsanitary conditions inside their 12th floor apartment. Sources tell us police have been to the apartment several times before for domestic violence. Apparently, all of the children had old bruises and cuts on their bodies, but neighbors say they saw nothing that would concern anyone. I always see her with her kids. She took them to school, brought them back. I'm on a PTA. I always see her. So I didn't expect for her to have problems like that. In a statement, a spokesperson for ACS said, the safety and well-being of New York City's children is our top priority. We are investigating this case with the NYPD.